Hi, I'm Tinny from Mini Bowl Design. It's about 8.30. Uh, the sun is just coming up over the top. It's only supposed to get up into the low 40s today, so it's going to be cold. You can see my breath or not, I can see it. Uh, the leaves are falling off the trees. This fall is pretty, foliage is pretty much over with. Just let the cats out. See one walking across the door yet. And I'm going to go out in the factory and uh, trying to get the uh, shadow from the camera off my face. <laughs> I'm going to go out in the factory and build up a fire and get to work. I got, uh, I've got a huge amount of work ahead of me. So let's go out in the factory and get a fire built up and warm up these old bones and uh, we'll talk about orders and the day's events. There, I got a fire going. Should be warm here in a few minutes. I'll turn the blower on when she starts to crackle and snap and heat up. I've uh, got a very challenging uh, list of things to build today. Uh, don't know whether I can finish it all today or not. I have the time, I just don't know there's enough tinny left to, uh, to build all that stuff. As uh, I think there's... Uh, Three or four elite, three elites I've got to build here, which in itself is, is quite a bit of work. A lot of the stuff I built yesterday and have in stock, like beer can rings and stuff. But uh, it's, uh, it's going to be a challenge. I, I look forward to doing uh, this stuff, and, and I, uh, I need the money. <laughs> But there are times when it uh, becomes a little bit overwhelming. I'm really looking forward to the day when I can uh, retire and start drawing Social Security and then this whole thing will change and uh, just a whole different mindset. But uh, that's a couple years away, so in the meantime, uh, i got to get busy and uh, get this stuff done. Uh, it's getting cold now. It's... Lots of nights it's in the 20s. It was down to like 25 last night. Uh, filled the stove up with wood, uh, the furnace with the new chimney and the new pipe and everything and, and adjusted everything. This morning I got up at let Zeke out at 5.30 and there was still a good bed of coals. I just threw some more wood in, uh, let it roar for five minutes, closed it all, went back to bed. When we got up it was 72 in the house. It was perfect. So I, I aced that one out. It's kind of an art form. Uh, learning how to, to run that stove with a new chimney, but uh, I think I think we're going to be all right. Uh, I had a little bit of a trouble getting a fire going out here this morning. It didn't really have any good kindling, so I finally broke down, went upstairs, and took a uh, cut-off saw and cut up some small stuff and brought it down and got things going. Now, uh, I've been following uh, these two people who are sailing around the world, on a 42-foot fiberglass sailboat. Uh, I think they're in the Caribbean right now. Uh, if you if you want to go look, just uh, type in uh, La L.A. La Vagabond. Uh, Riley and Elena are sailing on a on a ship called the uh, Vagabond. La Vagabond sailing La Vagabond. Uh, I find it extremely interesting. I'm it's uh, Something I never could do. I'm scared to death of deep water. Uh, I, I definitely would not be able to handle the stress of being uh, sailing across the Atlantic out away from land with all that responsibility and things that could go wrong. I'd just be a basket case in the fetal position down in one of the berths or something. That's totally out of my league, but I, I really, a uh, lot of footage, high definition footage of uh, what all the uh, villages and towns alike and all these little islands and the bays and a lot of underwater footage of them uh, spearfishing. They live on a lot of fish. In fact, uh, Elena got sick from uh, eating some fish and it had some bacteria in it. She was sick for about a week, really sick. Um, speaking of sick, I found out that uh, I, I rode my bike more this summer than uh, because Sue was with me, more than I've ever ridden before. And I, I built up a lot of muscle mass uh, in certain parts of my body uh, just from riding continuously every day, three times a day 
almost every day. And when it got cold, we just put the bikes away and stopped. And all those places where I built up a lot of muscle in my calves and my thighs, and even the, even the back of my neck from holding my head up looking forward, lower back from pushing on the pedals and arching your back, and, and my uh, biceps, all those muscles are, uh, they want to be exercised again. They're, they're just sitting there and that causes some pain I'm finding out uh, in the long run. If I go out and ride the bike, even in the cold for 15 or 20 minutes, pain all goes away. So if I was a wealthy man, and what I've always fantasized on having instead of sailing the Atlantic, sailed around the world like La Vagabond, I would build a bike into a bicycle track, heat it into a bicycle track. That would be my uh, my goal in life. I uh, can't afford it, but that that's what I would have if I could have anything I wanted. Uh, not going to happen, but... See, it's nice fantasy. Uh, well, I got to get to work. Okay, I'm all done for the day. Uh, it's around noontime. Beth is getting stuff shipped. Hopefully she'll get it all packaged up and down to the post office because the post office closes at 2. But uh, I think she'll make it. She's, it wasn't that many orders. It was just uh, fairly concentrated stuff. With... Cook kits and everything else all together had 12 lids, so I had to stop and make uh, a bunch of lids and a bunch of knobs. And anyway, uh, three elites, and, uh, and I'm all done now. So uh, hopefully, Beth will get it to the post office in time. I'm Tinny from Mini Bowl Design. Try to have a really great day and try to have some fun today. You deserve it. Bye bye.